Breaking News live. New Allegations against Sean Diddy Combs. 120 neuen Opfern, die sich gemeldet haben, darunter auch Minderjährige. The biggest secret in the entertainment industry that really wasn't a secret at all has finally been revealed to the world. I don't want to focus on the ages of these victims. Okay, jetzt wird sehr, sehr interessant, meine lieben Freunde. Our youngest victim at the time of the occurrence is, was nine years old. 25 of the 120 individuals who are plaintiffs in these cases were minors at the time. 25 minderjährige, bro. Some of this behavior occurred at private residences of people that we all know. Jay-Z. All of them were trying to land a record deal. All of them were minors. He needed a visit with him in private about it, away from his parents. Once uh, they were in a private area, allegedly Mr. Combs made the victim perform oral sex upon him. Ich liebe euch alle, egal ob ich schwarz oder weiß, denn ich spiel keine Rolle. Yo, was geht ab, meine lieben Freunde? Willkommen zu einer weiteren Reaction auf Leon Love Look Highlights und ich hoffe, bei euch zu Hause ist alles gut. Liebe geht raus an die Community und zwar ziehen wir uns ein neues Video rein. Breaking News live. New Allegations against Sean Diddy Combs. Wir haben da schon ein bisschen reingeguckt und ich habe gehört von 120 neuen Opfern, die sich gemeldet haben, darunter auch Minderjährige. Also es wird auf jeden Fall immer crazier, wenn ich das mal so nennen darf an der Stelle. Und wir gehen da jetzt live rein. Ist eine englische Pressekonferenz, aber mit deutschem Untertitel. Und das gucken wir uns jetzt an. Für alle, die kein Englisch können, Lernt bitte Englisch, denn diese News gibt es live nur auf Englisch und die werden dann Tage später von deutschen Leuten übersetzt. Mittlerweile auch viel schneller als früher, aber so live, live, live und direkt kannst du nur dabei sein, wenn du wirklich Englisch kannst. Nicht nur das, auch viele andere Informationen über die Welt. Gibt es viel heftigere Videos auf Englisch, deswegen würde ich euch empfehlen, lernt Englisch, meine lieben Freunde. Ich liebe euch. Lasst einen Daumen nach oben da, schreibt Kommentärchen, abonniert den Kanal. Und der Peter geht los, Digi, und los. As they speak, as many of you know, Our law firm has been at the forefront of some of the most important litigation in the United States. We like the tough cases. We thrive in the complicated cases. We've handled over the last 25 years some very big and very important cases. I believe that this one may surpass them all. There are many facets to this. Krass, der sagt, das ist eine der heftigsten Fälle, die die hier aufgenommen haben. Wer ist denn das? Das ist eine Law Firm, gell? Busby? Irgendwie so? Und äh, das ist jetzt kein Staatsanwalt oder so, gell? Das ist jetzt einfach eine Law Firm, die jetzt die Cases übernommen hat von diesen neuen, von diesen neuen äh, Opfern quasi, oder was? The conduct we will describe today occurred over more than 20 years. There are many people and many entities involved. And we're going to follow this evidence wherever it takes us. We will find the silent accomplices. We will expose the enablers who enabled this conduct behind closed doors. We will pursue this matter, no matter who the evidence implicates. These brave victims who have I hope so, bro. I hope so. Reden können wir alle, können äh, alle immer sehr gut, ne? Ob dann wirklich auch was umgesetzt wird und ob wirklich auch die richtig mächtigen Leute, die auch deine Law Firm kaputt machen könnten, auch ran, dran glauben müssen, bezweifle ich, Digga. Sorry, wenn ich das so sagen muss und so ein Skeptiker bin, aber viele Leute werden ohne, ohne Strafe davon kommen. Forward, deserve nothing less. The biggest secret in the entertainment industry that really wasn't a secret at all has finally been revealed to the world. Das hat er gut gesagt. The, the, the biggest secret in the music industry, das größte Geheimnis in der Musikindustrie, was nicht wirklich ein, was nicht wirklich ein Geheimnis war, ist, äh, kommt endlich, ja, kommt ans Licht, Digga, wird offenbart. The wall of silence has now been broken and victims are coming forward. Our team has had at this point more than 3,285 individuals contact us with people claiming, people claiming to have been victimized By Sean Combs. Okay, 3200 ist halt wild. Da sind bestimmt auch ein paar Trolls dabei, ne? After vetting, we now represent 120 individuals. Das ist krass, Digga. Also nachdem die die überprüft haben, sind jetzt 120 übergeblieben. Who intend to bring civil claims in civil court against Sean Diddy Combs. 120, Digga. As well as claims against many other individuals and entities that we will name as defendants. 
Krass, Digga. Also mit noch mehr Leuten, ne? Jetzt, jetzt, da wird's, da wird's interessant jetzt. Wer da noch mit alles drin war, da, 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 da wollen einige jetzt wissen, okay, ist dann Jay-Z mit dabei, ist dann, ist dann äh, Kevin Hart mit dabei, ist dann Asha mit dabei, so. We file these individual cases. And you should know, to the extent the clients feel comfortable, we also intend to make these individuals available to the authorities, specifically to the FBI. And you should also know a few of them have already been spoken to by the FBI. Now, before we discuss the nature of the claims and claimants themselves, let me comment on the large volume of calls we have received since our first announcement. Even before the indictment of Sean Combs, we had received a small volume of calls and had screened a handful of cases. After the indictment of Sean Combs and the announcement that we were pursuing these claims, the floodgates opened. People who wouldn't otherwise, for a variety of reasons, are now stepping forward to make their voices heard and to pursue justice. But no, most of these people are scared. They fear backlash in their communities. They fear backlash in their own families. They are afraid of retaliation from the perpetrators and their associates. They are rightly afraid for their own personal safety. Yeah, hundred percent, I think. I believe it. Yeah, I also. I had that also, shit, bro. I think so. It is. I had that also, shit. For all, when you know, when you, when you know, or when you, when you. Mies am Recherchieren bist oder schon davon gehört hast, was für Mächte überall mit involviert sind in solchen Geschichten. So. Ja, da hast du natürlich Angst auch ähm, um dein Leben, um deine Karriere, um deine Familie, um alles. I expect that through this process many powerful people will be exposed. Many dirty secrets will be revealed. We know what we are potentially up against. And as is always the case in situations like this, when a celebrity is involved, people can be downright mean and nasty. You would be shocked at the length fans will go, no matter the evidence, to the contrary, to defend celebrities they love. <laughs> das kennen wir ja von Deutschland auch. Da gab es auch schon mal den ein oder anderen Skandal, der rausgekommen ist. Und ja, Fans verteidigen das noch. Die wollen das nicht wahrhaben, Digi. Die reden das dann schön. Und die versuchen irgendwie daran festzuhalten, dass das ein guter ist. so, Weil die den gefühlt haben, seitdem die klein waren oder den schon seit Jahren verfolgen oder so, weißt du? Man will das halt nicht wahrhaben. Weil man die halt auch so, 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 so anhimmelt und denkt, die sind voll krass. Die werden ja wie Götter teilweise gesehen, die Stars. Und dann willst du es nicht wahrhaben, weißt du? Reason for this word fans. They're fanatics. I've personally already been threatened multiple times on social media. Leon, meintest du nicht, dass du selber jemanden kennst, der auf einer Diddy-Party war? Ja. Ja. Kenn ich. Ja, ich habe auch mal mit einem Artist geredet. <lacht> Bro, ich habe halt in Tulum gute Connections gemacht, was das, was international angeht. So habe ich mit ein paar New York-Leuten geredet. Und da gibt es auch jemanden, der, den man auch kennt. So, den kennt ihr auch, weißt du? Und ja, Bro. Diese Leute waren halt da schon mal live dabei gewesen, aber sind halt nicht da geblieben. Das ist, die Leute wussten, jeder wusste, der auf eine Didi-Party gegangen ist, jeder wusste, ab wie viel Uhr das losgeht. Das fängt dann langsam Schritt für Schritt an, die Musik verändert sich, auf einmal kommen irgendwelche Kostüme, äh, irgendwelche Leute mit Kostümen da rein und so und dann fangen die an, da rumzumachen und so. Und dann merkst du, okay, die Stimmung switcht und dann bleibst du entweder da oder du gehst halt. Du wirst ja nicht dazu gezwungen, mitzumachen. Weißt du, du wirst nicht dazu gezwungen mitzumachen, also nicht auf diesen offiziellen Partys auf jeden Fall. Hinter den Kulissen, I don't know, bro. Auf so privaten Dingern, privat privaten Dingern, sag ich mal. Media. And when I agreed to pursue this, I expected as much. This isn't my first rodeo. But victims who step forward to have their voices heard should not be subjected to that kind of conduct. They should not be targeted. I want to say this and I want to be clear about it. Although we are vetting each call as stringently as we can, I always start with a mindset that I believe victims. I believe victims. Because I understand the tremendous courage it takes to step forward. 
So if you're watching this, please hear me. If you're out there and you have been victimized, you are not alone. There is a great strength in numbers. You can seek redress. You can obtain justice. We can help you and we will help you. That being said, as stated, we are vetting every call that we receive. We've had to turn away some. For each, we ask for corroboration. For each, we ask for the identity of witnesses. We also have collected pictures, videos, texts. We check venues, check dates. We want to corroborate that the claims being made have legitimacy and merit. We have on staff now a former detective from the Major Offenders Unit of Houston Police Department who is helping us vet each claim. We're using our common sense. We're being stringent because, as I said, these are not easy cases. They're very tough. The process is hard, and in some cases, the process is very lengthy. These cases are hard to prove. Many times, it's the victim's word against the alleged perpetrator. Each of these victims will no doubt be publicly attacked by the alleged perpetrators, and in some cases, the general public. The feckless and cowardly keyboard warriors love to attack. We know what keyboard warriors think of Yulish. We're up against. We did not enter this fray blindly. I wish it was my last such fray. I wish this type of hate behavior wasn't so pervasive. But it is what it is, so we will press on. As I said, our law firms have been retained by 120 individuals at this point to pursue cases in civil court against Sean Diddy Combs. You should know, in this group, it is evenly divided between males and females. There are 60 males and 60 females Close. who have joined us to pursue these claims as plaintiffs. In this group, 62% identify as African American, 30% are white, and the remainder are Hispanic or Asian. The victim 50, 50, Frauen und Männer. are from more than 25 states. The majority are from California, New York, Georgia, and Florida. I don't want to focus on the ages of these victims. Okay, jetzt wird's sehr, sehr interessant, meine lieben Freunde. Jetzt wird's gerade sehr, sehr interessant. We talk about the ages of the victims when the conduct occurred. It's shocking. Our youngest victim at the time of the occurrence is, was nine years old. We have an individual who was 14 years old. We have one who was 15. 25 of the 120 individuals who are plaintiffs in these cases were minors at the time of the acts complained of. The time frame of the acts complained of is very... 25 minderjährige, bro. The conduct at issue spans from the years 1991 all the way till this year 2024. From 1991 bis 2024, brother. Let's see how long that has durchgezogen hat, bro. If you wonder why there are so many alleged victims, that's your answer. We're talking about more than 25 years of this type of conduct. Now, although most of the victims who have stepped forward were victimized after 2000... Man, wie bei Epstein, das hat man doch auch gesehen in der Dokumentation von Epstein, der hat dann irgendwie so rekrutiert, dann einfach Mädels, dann sind, dann hat er irgendwelche, dann ist diese Gislaine Maxwell, seine rechte Hand ist dann zu Schulen gegangen und hat dann jungen Mädels angeboten, 50 Dollar zu massieren und so ein Scheiß, Bro. Und so haben die halt ein, ein System daraus gemacht, um immer wieder neue, junge Leute an den Start zu bekommen, weißt du? 
So, und wenn du so ein Freak bist wie Didi und damit in den 90er Jahren anfängst und nach zehn, spätestens nach zehn Jahren hast du ein System entwickelt und denkst, oh ja geil, keiner kriegt mich an den Eiern, ich mach damit weiter. Digga, da gibt's ganz viele Opfer. Ganz viele, Digga. 15, this has been going on for a very long time. Now, when you think about the fact that some of this conduct occurred 25 years ago, and you wonder why would it take somebody so long to step forward, I want to remind you that, that many states in the United States have recognized that it's very difficult for a victim to step forward and to make these types of allegations when something very terrible has happened to them. I'll use New York, the state of New York, as an example. The state of New York has specific statutes in place that revive claims that are even claims that would typically be not able to be brought, that it revives such claims and they can be brought even 25 to 30 years later. Ja, das ist neu, da, so wurde doch doch der Harvey Weinstein äh, rangekriegt und dann trotzdem freigesprochen. Because there's a recognition there in New York and California and other states that, that it's very difficult for a victim to come forward. And I would, I would respectfully suggest the only reason many of these people are coming forward because they see Other victims coming forward. Ja, Digga, das ist, das ist, man muss sich ja halt doch mal in die Haut reinversetzen von einem Opfer so. Ne? Gerade wenn du noch minderjährig warst und so. Es ist überhaupt schon schwer, selber damit klarzukommen und irgendwie weiterzuleben. Und dann noch gegen so einen mächtigen Mann, Digga, der, der gefeiert wird von der ganzen Welt. So. Weißt du? Da dann den Mut zu haben, nach vorne zu kommen und zu sagen, ich stelle mich dagegen, mit was für einer Power auch, du, du, du brauchst ja auch Geld für diese ganzen Klagesachen und so. Also ich kann das schon verstehen, dass ähm, da viele Opfer sich erst melden, wenn die merken, dass sie auch eventuell eine Chance haben. Weißt du? And it gives them some comfort that, hey, I won't be the only one. So. And I expect more victims will come forward. You know, there's an old saying, it says, A lie has great speed. Er hat denen bestimmt auch Angst gemacht. Ja, ja, das ist ja schon rausgekommen mit Bedrohungen und, und Mord. Und der hat ja schon Leute aus der Industrie, die nicht gehorcht haben. Hast du ja gesehen, was der mit Cassie gemacht hat und so? Der hat der Brandstiftung und so, was auch der Staatsanwalt gesagt hat, weißt du? Der war für alles bereit, um, das, äh, äh, um, dieses, um dieses Netzwerk am Laufen zu halten und undercover zu bleiben, weißt du? Und klar hat er die bedroht, hundertprozentig. Truth has endurance. The acts complained of in these cases that we're going to file occurred primarily in New York, either Manhattan or the Hamptons, or occurred in California, primarily in Los Angeles, or in Florida, primarily in Miami. Most of these events and incidents occurred at parties, typically after parties, or album release parties, New Year's Eve parties, Fourth of July parties, something they called a puppy party, the all white party, although several of these events occurred at auditions. Uh, many times, uh, especially young people, people wanting to break into the industry were, were coerced into this type of conduct uh, in the promise of being made a star or in the promise of, of having um, Sean Combs listen to their tape or even let them read for Sean Combs. You should know that some of this behavior occurred at well-known venues in New York City. Hm. Some of this behavior occurred at private residences of people that we all know. <laughs> Jay-Z. Some of this behavior occurred at hotels that we're all familiar with. You should know that more than 55% of the victims filed reports, reported this conduct to either the authorities, that is the police, or to hospitals. We're in the process of collecting with our team assistance, uh, medical records, uh, reports that were made to the authorities. Krass, Alter, die haben, die, haben, die haben reported oder was teilweise? Warum wurde dem nicht gefolgt? And I've already said that some of the individuals in this group did in fact talk to the FBI. You should know that, that several of the individuals And when I say several, I mean many uh, who did, in fact, seek medical treatment were drug tested and drugs were found in their system. Weird drugs, drugs that you probably never heard of. One in particular that, that continues to pop up is a drug called xylazine or trank. What the fuck, bro? What's that they didn't give him, nigga? Which 
based on Xilazine. our research, is known as a horse tranquilizer. Beruhigungsmittel für Pferde, Digga. Im Ketamin mäßig, wa? Now, there's been a lot of reports that we're filing a class action. This is not a class action. Class actions when one or two people file a case on behalf of a group of people. That's not this. Keine Sammelklage, sondern einzelne 120 Einzelklagen, oder was? These cases will be individual cases. <lacht> Ach du Scheiße. Each case will live and die on its own merit. These cases will be filed individually. One plaintiff against whoever the defendants were. Digga, Didi is fucked, bro. Didi is fucked. Involved in the case. And other people too. I hope so. Each case may be filed in one venue like California. Another case may be filed in New York. One case may sue just Sean Combs, but multiple other people. One case may sue a range of people. Da bin ich gespannt, welche Range of People das sein werden. A range of people. I would expect most, though, to be filed, as I said, thinking or hoping, or perhaps uh, believing, that I may start naming names. Well, ja, Bruder, wir wollen einen Namen. The day will come, but it that won't. The day will come, but it won't, won't be today, sagst du, wa? Today. Na ja. Da muss man erstmal nochmal gucken, Digga, ob man das überhaupt so machen kann. Das ist halt krass, man. Hinter den Kulissen geht's gerade richtig ab, Conspiracy-mäßig, weißt du? Die Verschwörung dreht gerade am Rad auch. Die vergucken auch, bestechen gerade Leute, dass die nichts sagen. Wahrscheinlich werden von den Opfern auch einige verschwinden, Digga. Wer weiß, ob dem Anwalt irgendwas passieren wird. Es hört sich jetzt crazy an, aber glaubt mir, da sind, da sind Namen involviert, die halt so mächtig sind, die müssen sich beschützen und die machen alles dafür. They will come when we will name names other than Sean Combs. And there's a lot of names. <lacht> der macht die richtig geil, die der macht uns gerade richtig geil auf Namen jetzt gerade hier, Cousin. Sag doch mal von Seite. It's a long list already. And of course I already know who some of these individuals are, but because of the nature of this case, we're going to make damn sure. Damn sure that I already know who some of these individuals are, bro. What the Right before we do that. Uh, but the names that we're going to name der labert ohne Ende. Am Ende kommt niemand in den Knast und Didi hängt sich selber auf angeblich. Ja, man weiß es nicht. Man weiß es nicht. Man, die Hoffnung stirbt zuletzt. Weißt du, was ich meine? Ja, das kann natürlich so enden wie bei Epstein. Dass vielleicht noch eine weitere Person seine rechte Hand, so wie damals bei Epstein, die Maxwell noch irgendwie was zu rechnen hat. Der Rest von Epsteins Liste, mit dem ist nichts passiert, aber... Wer weiß, vielleicht ist es jetzt gerade anders, weißt du? Von Jahr zu Jahr kommt immer mehr ans Licht und wer weiß, ob vielleicht Names gedroppt werden und noch mehr Leute dran glauben müssen, die in solchen Sachen involviert waren. Ich weiß nicht, ich glaube, die müssen mindestens noch ein, zwei Leute müssen die äh, verhaften. So, da ist schon zu viel im Internet los, weißt du? Zu viele Leute haben schon die Augen geworfen auf, auf, auf Oprah, auf Jay-Z, auf, auf äh, äh, wie heißt er? Kevin Hart und so. I don't know. Assuming that our investigators confirm and corroborate what we've been told are names that will shock you. These are individual cases. There are indeed other perpetrators involved. They will be revealed when that particular individual case is ready to be filed. They already know who they are. And I'm talking here about not just the cowardly but complicit bystanders. That is, those people that we know watched this behavior occur and did nothing. And I'm talking about the people that participated, encouraged it, egged it on. They know who they are. Jay-Z, I'm zittern. I call them the facilitators of foul play, willing participants in vile conduct. As we identify them, each will be part of this case as defendants. These defendants will not only include individuals, but will also include corporate entities who ja, all okay, da, da sind wir jetzt. Da sind die Jungs, glaube ich, werden nicht dran glauben müssen. Really profited off of this culture and behavior. Nee, Digga. Life Davis chillt seine Eier, Digga, da passiert nichts. I'm looking at banks, pharmaceutical companies, hotels. We know that many of these individuals were paid cash. We know that, that 
Many of these individuals involved, whether they were the ones being assaulted and abused or they're witnessing other people being assaulted and abused and then paid and threatened and told to leave. Typically paid Der Anwalt scheint aber stabil zu sein, aber er muss sein Talk jetzt auch walken, wie ich Ja, 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 er muss sein Bestes geben auf jeden Fall. Er muss sein Bestes geben. Die sind halt motiviert, die Jungs, ne? Ich denke mal, der Bruder bei Epstein damals, ne, das war die Staatsanwaltschaft, ne? Das ist ja hier jetzt ein, ein Corporate-Anwalt, oder nicht? Also aus der Privatwirtschaft mäßig. Im Hintergrund, wie ich schon gesagt habe, im Hintergrund werden Fäden gezogen. So, es, ist, es, ist, es ist halt nicht so einfach, weißt du? Wenigstens probiert er was. Und wir gucken mal, wie weit es gehen wird. Nichts erwarten und froh sein, wenn irgendwas passiert. Grand in cash and told to leave. And then threatened as they were leaving. So in addition to Sean Combs, you should know the defendants in these cases we're going to file will include anyone, of course, who engaged in the assault or exploitation, anyone who participated in such in any way, anyone who encouraged or facilitated this conduct, anyone who was in the room and watched it happen but made no effort to stop it, any venue or venue owner who was aware of what was going on but failed to stop it, any individual or entity who knew about the conduct and benefited from it but did nothing to report it or stop it, and any individual or entity who covered it up or helped cover it up. These people who know who they are should just come forward now. I would imagine as we speak here, there are a myriad of people who are very nervous. You can't hide skeletons in the closet forever. I would expect there are many people out there right now. Nee, du kannst die schon lange im Schrank verstecken, mein Jutzter. Wie gesagt, beste Beispiel Jeffrey Epstein. Wer ist da? Wer ist von der Liste verhaftet worden? Sag mir einen Namen. Who are, who are desperately searching their memories as they delete their texts and data. Now, although these are, in fact, individual cases, there is a common theme, MO, if you will. Typically, the victim is lured into a situation where he or she is given a drink. Typically, that drink uh, reported by these victims is apparently laced with something. Once that drink takes effect, the perpetrators perform all kinds of sexual acts on the victims, many times passing him or her around as other people watch and enjoy the show and then leave the victim ashamed, confused, injured, and wondering what happened. When the victim reaches out, he or she is told not to say anything. Sometimes there are threats of all physical violence or financial repercussions or bodily harm. The claims we intend to bring will include the following, violent sexual assault or rape, sexual abuse, facilitated sex with a controlled substance, false imprisonment, compelling prostitution, sexual misconduct, dissemination of video recordings, false imprisonment, sexual abuse of minors. Given a large volume of cases. Was ist mit den ganzen Tapes und so? Irgendeiner hat gemeint, dass die auf äh, im Darknet, dass es da angeblich irgendwelche Tapes schon gibt und dass die, die die selber verkauft hätte und so. Was mit diesen ganzen Tapes? Was ist auch mit den ganzen Tapes von Epstein's Island? Da gibt es Videos einfach, ja. Wo sind die alle? Wo sind die ganzen Videoaufnahmen? Wer hat die? Was passiert damit? Given our other docket obligations and given the fact that we want to be sure when we file these cases that they are fully vetted, I expect we'll start filing these cases against Sean Combs. Kann man doch niemals geheim halten. Wenn, wenn die im Darknet sind, dann kann, die müssen doch dann irgendwo auch im Internet auftauchen. Das kannst du doch niemals geheim halten, wenn da irgendwelche Leute, wie, was haben die gesagt, wer da alles involviert ist? Chris Brown oder was auch immer hat da? What they can do about it. So I, I thought I'd take this opportunity before I go. You know, sexual abuse, sexual exploitation, uh, these types of, this type of activity is pervasive in our society and it's rare we get a chance where, where uh, we can really focus on this as a country and really focus on this about how pervasive this is and what we can, as collectively can do about it. So I, I thought I'd take this opportunity before I go into some of the individual cases and talk about some of the individual 
claims being made and some of the so you'll get a get a sense of what this 120 people group looks like individually I want to bring forward uh, Carrie Paul she's a national victim advocate uh, who uh, helps victims uh, who have been um, victimized uh, by this type of conduct and she has some important words and I hope you'll you'll pay close attention I think it's important that you hear from her die machen jetzt halt so ein bisschen Prävention für das Thema, ist auch wichtig, Digga, aber wir konzentrieren uns hier erstmal nur äh, auf den Fall. But let me let me share with you a few a few just kind of give you a sense of the kind of cases and the kind of instances that people are calling and reporting that we are trying to corroborate, vet, uh, and these are the ones that we've already corroborated, vetted and collected evidence on. Um, One individual who was 22 years at the time um, she was assaulted said that uh, the, the typical MO at one of these parties that have been wide. Jetzt geht's in die Details rein, was da, was die, was die, ähm, die Ankläger halt jetzt, äh, also von diesen 120 Leuten, was die genau erlebt haben und wie das vonstatten ging. Discussed um, in the press was that when when you were handed a drink. And now we know that the drink is laced with something. If you refuse to drink it, you were kicked out of the party. Oh, no. shit. Also, die haben den Drink gegeben und, <laughs> und da war was drin. Und wenn du den nicht trinken willst, dann musstest du gehen. Let that sink in for a minute. I mean, the admission to this party was that you had to drink this, the chosen drink that was handed to you. Uh, and now we know that that in in most cases, I would say 90% of the cases, uh, these individuals were drugged with some sort of drug. That's that was kind of the mo. Another instance, uh, this individual who was nine years old at the time. Oh, this is hot, bro. Uh, was uh, taken to a audition in New York City with Bad Boy Records. Uh, other boys were there to audition as well. All of them were trying to land a record deal. All of them were minors. Uh, this individual was sexually abused, allegedly by Sean Combs. Nine is crazy, bro and several other people at the studio uh, in the promise uh, to both his parents and uh, to him himself of getting a record deal. Um, another instance, another minor, uh, told allegedly by Sean Combs that he would make him a star, but he needed a visit with him in private about it, away from uh, his parents. Once uh, they were in a private area, Allegedly, Mr. Combs made uh, the victim uh, perform oral sex upon him. Das sagt dann noch alles zu Asche und äh, Justin, ah ja. Das sind halt alles Vorwürfe noch, ne? Aber. Uh, another incident. Uh, an individual 15 years old at the time flown uh, to New York City to attend a party, uh, was drugged and then taken into a private room, uh, allegedly in the presence of Mr. Combs, uh, where this uh, female individual minor was raped and then other individuals took turns raping her. Wäre dabei jetzt nicht gerade zu beleidigen und ein bisschen auszurasten, so sag ich dir so, wie es ist, gell? Another individual, 26, at the time of the occurrence, uh, was picked up by, allegedly, by Mr. Combs and several other people uh, in a black SUV from the airport. Uh, was given one drink in the SUV and then literally woke up the next day not knowing what had happened. Take 
dick. But with pain and damage to both her vagina and her anus, where she was then, she then went to the hospital. She was missing her underwear and her shoes. Another instance, an individual, uh, this time not a minor, uh, was attended a group dinner, allegedly with Sean Combs in Miami. Uh, she wasn't drinking because she was pregnant, uh, but she... Was she minda years and pregnant? Whatever she drank at the table, apparently, at least according to her, was laced with something. She blacked out, and she woke up in the same bed, again, allegedly, with Mr. Combs. Uh, in his uh, mansion in Miami, her vagina and her anus were torn and sore. Um, and I could go on. I mean, literally, you, you, you're, you're sensing a theme here. It's, it's the same theme. Uh, and it all involves uh, some sort of drug. Um, one instance... And immer Versprechungen wahrscheinlich, ne? Auf Karriere und so. Ich bin Diddy und so, ich mach dich reich, ich mach dich zum Star, bla 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 bla. Mann, es gibt leider sehr viele mächtige Leute, die diesen Status ausnutzen, bro. ...who was 20 years old at the time, uh, was asked to attend, just saw her on the street, asked to attend a party in a hotel. Um, she was flattered, went to the party, was given one drink and doesn't remember anything else. Digga. Ultimately, was so messed up, was went to the hospital where they found um, cocaine and this horse tranquilizer in her blood system. I want to give you a quote from a very young man uh, who told us over the phone about his experience and all the things that happened to him, uh, he says, allegedly at the hands of Sean Diddy Combs and his friends uh, in the effort to try to sign um, a record deal. Uh, this was kind of what he was told he would have to do. His quote is, had he not been in power, I feel like I could have been something great. I quit, I quit the industry because of what Sean Combs did to me. And that's really what it comes down to. We are pursuing this, asking you to support this effort to encourage witnesses and victims to come forward and bring your evidence so we can continue to break down this wall of silence and we can continue uh, to have these stories heard. Um, this is the beginning of what I hope to be a national dialogue. This type of sexual assault, sexual abuse, and sexual exploitation should never happen in the United, St in the United States or anywhere else. This should have never been allowed to go on for so long. This conduct has created a mass of individuals who are injured, scared, and scarred. If you are one of those individuals, we ask you to reach out. If not to us, to someone you trust. If you are someone who witnessed any of these events, we ask you to reach out. Your name can remain confidential. With that, um, I'll take a few questions, not many, maybe two, uh, but if you have a question, I'll be pleased to try to answer it. Safe, Sonia, safe. Perfect. How many minors are being accusations in total, and are the feds aware of the allegations of minors in the case? I don't know what the feds are aware of, okay, but I do know it's 25 out of this 120. And I will, I will say this to that point. Um, we welcome the FBI or any authority who wants to come to us, and we're going to make that available to these victims because I think that's important. Um, I, my, my suspicion is, based on uh, talking with these folks, is that, that, you know, the FBI is just not aware of these people. Uh, the FBI has talked to some of these folks, uh, and I'm going to try to make, encourage the victims uh, to in fact talk to the FBI because I think they have some very important things to say. Tony, yes. were all of the children auditioning because they were musicians or were any of them uh, kids of employees or anything like that? All, all seeking either TV or some sort of music career with promises of... Yeah, this might be the promises, bro. You know, we're going to make you a star.
instead basically did things to them such that they don't want to have anything to do with the entertainment industry ever again. All right, guys. Thank you very much for your attention. We're going to go now. Thank you. Crazy stuff auf jeden Fall, ja. Krass, krass. Wir haben uns die Pressekonferenz reingezogen, meine lieben Freunde. Oha, Digga. Das hat eben noch irgendwie 10.000 Views gehabt oder so. Vor zwei Stunden 400.000 Views. Das geht viral, sein Vater gerade. Guck mal, du siehst auch, ja. Die ganzen amerikanischen äh, Streamer reagieren auch gerade drauf schon. Heftig. Ja, crazy auf jeden Fall. Ich liebe euch, meine lieben Freunde. Schreibt mal eure Gedanken dazu unten in die Kommentare rein. Und ich bin echt schockiert, dass da 120... Also, es sind natürlich alles nur Vorwürfe. Aber bei den Sachen, die schon rausgekommen sind, kann man sich halt vorstellen, dass bei einigen diesen Sachen definitiv auch was hinten dran steckt. Und dass einfach 25 oder 28 Minderjährige da mit dabei sind, bei den 120 Leuten, ist einfach schockierend. Das ist ja das, was die vielen Leute schon vermutet haben, auch in Hinsicht auf Asher oder auf... Ähm, wie heißt er? Justin Bieber. Und krass, es ist verstörend. Und ich hoffe, dass wirklich auch was passiert und dass auch noch weitere Namen genannt werden von den Leuten, die da mit involviert waren, die da mit dabei waren, die da mit partizipiert haben. Und ja, dass die auch mit Konsequenzen zu rechnen haben, weil die haben es einfach verdient. So. Ich küsse euer Herz. Ich liebe euch, meine lieben Freunde. Wir sehen uns im nächsten Video. Macht's gut. Bis dahin. Peace out. Gang.